Alrighty guys, what's up? It's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Sword and Shield walkthrough, the Isle of Armor edition, Sword Re Ah, god damn it. What's up guys? It's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Sword and Shield walkthrough, the Isle of Armor edition. Shield version? I think, yeah. I was about to say sword version. <laughs> yes, guys, we are in shield version right here, and we are going to be continuing our little trial thingy right here. So in the last episode, we got to capture, or not capture, but we got to battle fast slow pokes. Seriously, guys, fast slow pokes. And, well, what does that say? Well, we found them, we got them, and then on top of that, we got ourselves a new Pokemon. As many of you guys already know from yesterday's episode, I got myself a Bulbasaur. From right here, I got myself Leonardo the Squirtle, and we're going to try and evolve these Pokemon. Now, there is something very special about this Pokemon right here, and that is that it can Gigantamax, and if you guys don't know what it is, it has that symbol right there next to his name, the X symbol, meaning once it's fully evolved, once you Gig or Dynamax the Pokemon, it will have a new form definitely new moves and all that stuff something that you, you you guys would probably want this is this goes with Godzilla Godzilla and quite a few other Pokemon that you can actually find around here so let's go right ahead and continue on our adventure right here because you know destiny awaits alrighty it's raining hey Draven my bad my bad okay what's up what's up how you doing there it's just dawned on me that you're brand new, uh, you're brand new to the Isle of Armor. I bet you have no idea where to even begin looking for the Max Mushrooms. Come on, let's go for a walk and I'll show you some Mushroom Hotspots. I promise you guys that I will not mess up this one right here, okay? Yeah, yesterday's episode was a little bit funny. It was, it was pretty funny, huh? Yeah, so here we are. He gives us a bit of a shortcut. And he's going to tell us. Now, usually the the forest of focus is a, a chock full of max mushrooms. But the thing is, a swarm of greed and came, uh, came through and ate every last one here. So, I'm thinking maybe you'll have more luck finding max mushrooms if you go check in the warm-up tunnel. It's out on the other side of the forest. Hmm. Okay. Out. Okay, so just, wa uh, just watch where you're going in the forest, okay? It's really easy to get lost. Anywho, good luck with the hunt for the Max Mushrooms. Catch you back at the dojo. Yeah, when he says it's a little, uh... Yeah, when, when he says that you'll get lost, you you definitely get lost. Because, yeah. In the sword version uh, of this whole place right here, I got really lost. I went to a different cave, and yeah, it wasn't really... I, I really didn't like it. I, I didn't like it at all, but I did a lot of things. I found a lot of, you know, ma uh, not Magikarp, but a lot of uh, Diglets. And here we have the Diglett Ma, and yes, if you give your, if you give her a few Armorite Ore, she will be able to find some good stuff for you. And if you guys have seen in the, yesterday's episode, yeah, I probably got myself a lot of wattages, and I mean lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of wattages. And crap baskets. Okay, so her thing broke. And wait, my lovely shovel is whispering. And still wants to dig. Second win. Here I go. Yeah. Okay. Oh wow, she is digging. Oh damn! Three pieces of armorite ore. If I stop now, you'll get four pieces of armorite ore. Let's go right ahead and keep on digging, homegirl. Okay, alright. And sorry, it hit a rock hard. My lovely shovel broke. Armorite ore, where you're supposed to get, is gone. Such a life. And you, okay, wow. So it is a bit of a gamble. Not much like luck this time right here. So. Let's go right ahead and just continue getting some berries, talking about life, try not to get lost and all that stuff because that's always fun. That's always very, very fun to get lost and whatnot. So let's go ahead and grab some apricorns right here and some berries too. And well, as you can see, you can actually get, oh wow, you can get this Pokemon too. I will be capturing you later on. Yes, guys. Uh, I'm actually refraining from capturing any of these Pokemon right now because, you know, the mission at hand. Kind of want to do that first before I continue on uh, do anything crazy right here. Plus, if 
the amount of time that I have, I think it's best if we actually, you know, focus on the adventure. And, well, let's see. We could actually go right here. So let's go ahead and get on our bike and look at this. There is a Pokemon right here. Oh, shoot. It's that lobster Pokemon that I have yet to find out what it's called. And, well, let's see. I think I see an Accelor. Always wanted one of those Pokemon. It's a very powerful Pokemon. And, well, let's see. We're going to try and steer away from these guys and look at this all right bring it on i want to actually get this guy right here this guy is a cell a Selgor, a pokemon from unova now this guy this guy and its counterpart are, are pretty much the how, how how should i put it these guys are very interesting to say the least because they they come out to be very very strong as bug type Pokemon. And here we go with a Hydro Pump and oh wow, yeah, never mind. Thanks a lot, Deadshot. But wow, Leonardo has grown to level 20. <laughs> okay, all right, level 20 it is in just one fell swoop. Okay, that was good. That is good. All righty. Okay. And let's go ahead and teach it bite. Man, you gotta love this game right here. You really do. Okay, so there you go, bite. Wants to learn water pulse. There we go, let's take away withdrawal for just right now. And what else, what else? Protect. Let's uh, not teach that. And let's see, I think that's pretty much it, but here comes Digivolution time. All right, Leonardo, time to evolve into your proper form right here. Oh, and look at that. Look at that. We got War Turtle. And look at this. Okay, so what we're looking at right now is War Turtle, the turtle Pokemon. It cleverly controls its furry ears and tail to maintain its balance while dry well, while uh, swimming. And after that, we, well, we're of course, it's trying to learn Protect. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Come on, man. Come on. Okay, so that is that. I think we should, uh, yeah, I think we should head on into, yeah, we should head on into the cave right here. Not get lost. There's a Goombi. Kind of want to get a Apricorns, you know, because there is something that can actually make your Apricorns into Pokeballs. You know, that kind of stuff. Kurt's not here, but, you know, we'll still get some stuff. And look at this. Okay, so here we go again. Another Apricorn. And we got so many Apricorns right now. And four black, two citrus, and one red Apricorn, one blue, and one yellow. Okay, so that was a good score right there. I want to capture you, but not right now. Okay. And this is actually a very good place to actually evolve it since it's raining. And let's go right ahead and get that, the Tony Mushroom. And, well, let's see. What do we got right here? Oh, yes. We got more. We got more of these. That's one. There's two. So there's only four acre, or the green apricorns are falling off. So I guess we got five green apricorns, which is nice. And let's see. We just got to get this right here and talk to this person. If I brought back a Fungus instead of a Max Mushrooms, do you think they'd notice? Yes, they will. You'll notice it. If, if you guys haven't seen any other Kung Fu movies or anything like that, or Dragon Ball, the Master always knows. And you will pay. And it will not be pretty. And is that Scyther? Holy shit, Scyther! Tauros. Chansey! Oh my god. These are definitely Pokemon that I want to capture. And, and Miltank, you know, Miltank too. And, well, let's go over that. And Kangaskhan! Oh, my God. I'm in heaven. This place right... Oh, and Stoutland from Scotland? Oh, my God. Yeah, now I really want to capture all these Pokemon, but I think I already have Stoutland from Scotland on my on my, on my PC, so it shouldn't be a big issue. There's Kangaskhan. I want to capture you. And what cave is this? Okay, so let's talk to this guy. Oi, oi! We don't get too many trainers out in these parts! They call me Diggin' Pa. You've met, you met the Diggin' Duo. They're, well, they're my sons. Haven't you got Amrai um, Ore, have you? You know, it's a rare type of rock at the Isle of Armor known for. If you just give us a few pieces of ore, I'll put these gold muscles straight to work, digging uh, you up lots of loads of watts. 
And you know what? Our meeting feels like a real struck of luck. If you like, I'll dig up some watts for free to mark my mark the occasion. You'll need to jot down uh, your progress first, though. Okay. And well, here we go. We got three thousand, two thousand, two thousand again, one thousand five hundred, five thousand. Good dodge! Ah! Oh my God! Oh, this guy's going. He's going to town right here. Look at this. Okay. Yes. Keep on going. Whew. That's all the digging I've uh, got in me. Okay, how many? Hold, hold, hold on, I can still keep digging. Gah! Oh, he, he, he's turning Super Saiyan, I think. <laughs> Feels like a dig up a walk trove like I haven't seen in ages. Here goes! What is going on? 5,000, 5, whoa, whoa, whoa! Damn, this guy's getting 5,000s! Wow, we are hitting the mother load of watts. Oh my god. Lord have mercy. Lordy lord. <laughs> One last go then. Digging Giga Impact. Oh shoot. There's 70,000 watts. Whew. Right, feels like I've settled down a bit. You've dug up 140,000 watts. Wow. I've dug up 1,500 now. Shall I keep digging? Yes! Keep on digging! I need more watts! Whew! That's all the digging I got in me. Yeah, I dug up 1,000 or 186,100 watts altogether. That is a lot of wattage. That is a boatload of wattage. Okay, so here we are in warm up tunnel. There's a sand true. There is a torkoal right there. Don't need it, but I spy with my little eyes a mushroom. And there's a thick club right there. Do not want to antagonize the, uh, the the Kangaskhan right here. But oh my god, here we go. Max mushrooms. Yes, we are going to pick them off. And wait just one moment. Uh-oh. It's this guy and his prissy ass uh, music. <sighs> <sighs> Just as I expected, multiple max mushrooms growing in a bunch. My psychic powers picked up these max mushrooms eons before you found them. I believe I should be the one to get those max mushrooms. First come, first served, and all. No, you can no way. Huh. I know you wouldn't listen to reason. I find your presence most disturbing. You show up at the dojo unannounced and go on and show such talent even though you're still so young. You dare get in my way. I warned you about my psychic powers, and now you'll experience them firsthand. You know, I'm not that scared. I really am. I'm not. I'm just looking at them, and I'm like, come on, bring it on. Bring it on, Avery. I'm doing what The Rock is doing. Just bring it. Oh, and look at that. He's got himself in a lowland slowpoke. So, I think it's about time we found out which of us is truly superior. All right, you prissy ass asshole. Time to get, uh... Well, time to get the Sucker Punch, since this is the first hit right here, right? Sucker Punch for the win. Oh my god, Slowpoke nearly did it. And he's like, oh, cheeky, let's agree move. Uh, let's that move is banned from now on, yes? And here comes a Confusion attack. Confusion, can it do it? No, it really doesn't. So let's go straight for a U-turn attack right here. And U-turn really messes up Slowpoke. Yeah, buddy. You didn't like that, and here we go, Deadshot's coming back to good old Draven right here. And all my Pokemon are growing levels, including Leonardo right here. And, well, let's see, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon to... Let's go to Blitzkrieg. The bass version. Or base version. Okay, here we go, Blitzkrieg buff, ready to do some damage. And here comes a Kadabra. You know what, let's go ahead and switch it out, because yeah, Blitzkrieg... Not the Pokemon for this job right here. So let's go ahead and switch out Blitzkrieg. And here we go. Beelzebon ready to take some, uh, kick some mash right here. And well, let's see. We can do one of two things. Let's go with a false surrender. And here comes a swift attack from Kadabra. Not much damage right there, but here comes false surrender. And this one destroys Kadabra. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, look at this. Okay, Beelzebub, level 76. Leonardo just growing levels like crazy. And here comes a Woobat. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's go to Blitzkrieg now, the actual Pokemon. 
Blitzkrieg. Okay, alrighty, so let's go right ahead. He's like, I am not weak, I cannot lose. Okay, you four-eyed freak. Here we go. Wubat ready to go down. Here comes an overdrive attack from Blitzkrieg himself. Look at that, just rubbing his belly. Say goodbye to Wubat. Oh, yes. Okay. And Leonardo, again, continuing the, the, the levels. And, well, let's go ahead and replace its water gun attack right here. Okay, alrighty. And we have defeated Avery, and he's like, my, my side strike is too, or what a side strike to my poor pride. Man, you talk a lot. You really do. Can't also read. <laughs> Blast it! Victory still deludes me. What is it that I lack? What do I need? Very well. You can have those ones. I'll go find myself some max mushrooms uh, that are far more elegant. Avery, teleport! Or more like run. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab these three max mushrooms. And uh, well, we got three max mushrooms, and the, these are the mushrooms that uh, have power to power of changing Dynamax forms. They boost all sets of the Pokemon during the battle. And here we're getting a beep, 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 and hello, hello, is this Draven's phone? How's the trial coming along, love? Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You mean you've already managed to find three max mushrooms? I've been checking in on everyone's progress, but it seems that you're the first place uh, once again. You really are a new rising star, aren't you? I suppose I'd better go put the pot on the stove, but you can be careful on your way back. Ciao! Okay. So that right there is how you get the three, uh, three, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, three mushrooms. And, well, here we have a Diglett again. And we need to find two more in the crap baskets on a crapsicle stick. <sighs> okay, guys. So there was a little bit of a a little bit of a technical difficulty right there. Uh, so yeah, I got done with this episode, and unfortunately, I didn't realize that I was using the wrong memory card for this recording because the memory card I was using was only 16 gigs so it only saved the amount of uh, footage that it could save luckily for us it got everything that we needed to get when we were uh, looking for the mushroom so here we are back into the area where we need to go to to get to the master do uh, dojo so we're we're all good we're good it's just a it's just a quick uh, miss or not a misunderstanding it's just a quick my bad for me Luckily, it didn't get all the important parts right here, guys. So, here we are going back to the Master Dojo, and, well, after obtaining all those, uh, or after obtaining the, the the Max Mushrooms, you'll be able to go inside of the Dojo and get, like, something pretty interesting right here. So, of course, Daddy's home. And here we are back into the Dojo. Uh, Miss Honey is actually cooking up some stuff for us right there. And, well, here we have Master Roshi himself looking at his students. They don't look so happy. Hey there, Draven. Welcome back. Looks like you nailed the trial. Congrats on finding the Max Mushrooms. A trial number two was no problem for you. All my other students ended up uh, getting lost in the, st in the forest. Turns out finding Max Mushrooms was the least of their problems. It's a shame. But I guess everyone other than Draven will fail the trial. <laughs> wow. Throwing serious shade onto these people right here. Well, first things first, a proper meal. Let's have Max Mushrooms made into delicious smack soup, shall we? Alrighty, okay. Okay, let's go do this. And again, thank God that we didn't um, mess up on this part right here. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I really outdone myself this time. Now all that's left is to add are, are those lovely Max Mushrooms you brought us. Uh-oh, here we go. Miss Sunny, I beg you, wait just a moment. Why, Avery? What in the world has gotten into you? I've never seen you in such a flutter. Pant, pant, pant. Alright, I've also obtained some max mushrooms. Oh, nice work, Avery. You must, uh, you must have searched hard uh, for those. That makes you the second person to pass the second trial. Sniff, I did! Yes, I did uh, search rather hard. Aw, oh, chin up, darling Avery. You did it! This is a cause for celebration! It is, kind of, but, you know, it's kind of my moment right now, so move out of the way, Junior. Master, Miss Honey, 
If you would grant me one wish, just this once, I would be indebted. Would you be so kind to use my max mushroom in the max soup? I feel like that everyone here should enjoy the taste of my efforts. Oh, Avery. Well, if that's what you're after, then I'm perfectly happy to oblige. Though, this is hardly the first time you've asked for something, and I'd rather doubt that it'll be the last. Miss Honey. I hope you don't feel that your thunder's being stolen, Draven. Kinda is. Look at his smug look. Kinda wanna punch him in his guts. Yeah, give it to him. I'll make sure to let my Pokemon do the talking. But we're a family here, and family shares, so we'll go ahead and use Avery's mushrooms for today. It's just so rare for him to try it hard at something. I really want to reward that. You understand, don't you? Nope, not really. You can hold on to the max mushrooms you found. I'm sure you'll find good use for them. Oh, and don't worry. You still totally passed the trial with flying colors. Think of those max mushrooms as an extra reward. Okay, so... Looking at Miss Honey cooking up the soup, and look at those clouds. You know that there's something's pretty cool going on right there. And well, all right, everybody, soup's on. The famous Max Soup of the Max Master Dojo. Well, I'm famished. Time to dig in. Let's eat. Well, we enjoyed it, and oh, I never did explain the big deal about this soup, did I? You see, when one drinks the dojo's famous Max Soup, you feel an energy dynamax swelling up from you inside you. No, you don't. That kind of thing doesn't happen if a human has a soup. But things are a bit different when certain Pokemon drink the soup. You see, there are some Pokemon that have distinct potential. And when they drink the soup, the, their dynamax form will change into Gigantamax form. I'll keep one for our lads in this, uh, or keep one of our lads in the kitchen on the soup duty uh, from now on, though. So you can ask to serve up a fresh bowl of Max Soup whenever you need. Hooah! Now then, let's wrap things up. You all did your best on the second trial, and I'm proud of everyone here. And last but not least, thanks for the soup, honey. Thanks for the soup, Miss Honey! Okay, let's see. By the way, Draven, meet me in my room when you have a moment. Alrighty, okay, so... That right there concludes the second ep or the second trial of this whole Isle of Armor thing in sword or shield version. Again, I do apologize for the little bit of a technical difficulty right here, guys. Didn't read the whole instruction thing on my uh, my USB thing. But in the next episode, it will be a little bit more fun than what we have right here. So thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys next time.